CTS Classic Cold 7x12 TA2 aluminum framed refrigerated trailer. We have this trailer both in steel frame and in aluminum frame. This is our aluminum frame trailer version. This trailer weighs 2,165 pounds empty. Has a gross vehicle weight rating of 7,000 pounds, which gives you just under 5,000 pounds cargo carrying capacity. Exterior of the trailer is a screwless aluminum exterior. Two tandem 3,500 pound axles with 205-75 R15 radial tires. Rear of the trailer, you can see that it has double cam bar locks on the back for opening both the left door or the right door. They do overlap and seal twice with a double seal uh, to keep the trailer nice and cool and cold inside. Down the opposite side of the trailer, very similar to the curbside. The trailer is equipped with all LED lighting on the exterior. So no need to replace bulbs and things like that inside. This trailer is also equipped with a Honda 3000 IE gas generator. It has uh, electric start with a key, which is very nice. It's also very quiet and very low decibel rating on the generator itself. The trailer has a expanded metal aluminum tread plate box uh, for housing the generator on the front side. The trailer is cooled by a Govi Arctic 2000 USA. Runs on 110 volt, 15 amp power, which is very nice. The trailer is also equipped with stone guard across the front. Protect the front of the trailer. The trailer generator is currently running. So you can hear the lamp, how loud the generator is, so it's very quiet. You also hear the cooling unit is also running, cooling the trailer currently. If I go to the control panel on the side of the unit, currently, the trailer is 58.5 degrees. It's been running about 20 minutes. Uh, we started at 97 degrees exterior. So we've actually brought the temperature down about 40 degrees in those 20 minutes. We've let it run for about another 20, it will cool down as well. Inside the control panel, you can see the easy set mode for setting your temperature. An on off for the power unit. Also has a on off for the light switch inside the unit. So very easy. It does have a drain tube down below for draining uh, water off the evaporator. The is equipped with a hot gas defrost, so it's going to defrost the unit automatically. Um, keeps it from freezing up and lasting longer. The trailer is also equipped with a 50 foot motor base cord. A 50 foot cord, it's a 10 gauge wire, and it will run in up at any 110 volt 15 amp outlet. So you got 50 feet to get that trailer close, or you can plug it in and run to the generator and operate it off the back. Very easy to do. Come around here to the back side, open up the back, and show you the interior of the trailer. Talked about the double cam bar locks on the back. They are overlapping for a tight seal, and both door have their own compression fittings uh, to keep them nice and closed, as well as four strap hinges on each door for the weight of the door for long use and life of the trailer. Here's the rear door of the trailer we talked about. Inside the trailer, we have a freeze curtain at the back of the trailer. That freeze curtain is designed to keep the air in. It also is hinged and can be locked open to the side as shown on this side, for cleaning. So you can hinge it over and lock it open if you're loading a lot of items into the trailer or also for easy cleaning of the uh, interior of the trailer as well. This trailer is constructed with four inches of spray foam closed cell insulation. So that insulation actually is all the way on the roof, the floor, walls, all the way around the whole entire trailer. The trailer is an aluminum skin finished inside and there are seamless walls, aluminum finished as well. They are very durable. The trailer is also equipped with three rows of surface mounted E-Track on the walls. So the consumer can tie down all kinds of different things all the way around or even put load bars from wall to wall inside the trailer to control your load for going down the road. The floor of the trailer is a one-piece seamless rubber coin flooring. 
As you can see, it's pulled up the walls 12 inches. That makes it nice and easy to clean out the trailer. Crank the towing up a little bit, come here, spray it out, and the water will run right out the back door. On the front wall of the trailer, we have the 110 volt jelly light. It's operated from the control panel up front in the GOVI unit we saw earlier. And here is our cooling unit inside the trailer. It comes in about 14 inches off the front wall. So that's all the space it takes from inside the actual footprint of the trailer. This trailer being 7 by 12 actually gives you 6 foot 2 clearance inside the trailer. It gives you 6 foot 2 wall to wall and gives you 11 foot 4 from the front to the rear of the trailer on the floor space. Our most popular size we offer. We do offer a 6x10s uh, and a 7x16 and a dual cool unit. But 7x12 by, by far is our most popular trailer. At 9 degrees ambient temperature, this trailer will maintain, as long as you keep the doors closed, 20 degrees inside with an ambient temperature of 90 degrees on the outside. Hope you've enjoyed this video of this trailer. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call at 888-824-4285. Once again, this is a CTS Classic Gold Aluminum Frame 7x12 T82. Thanks for watching.